Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Thursday, we're coming at you with some baseball on football opening night. 2020 Topps Chrome Baseball 12 box, pick your team number 14. Very big thanks to all of these lovely people here for getting into the action right here, Thursday the 10th. If you have a little rooftop next to your name, that means you won that in the, uh, in the filler pack break right here. So thanks everyone. Got TJ with Last Spot Mojo, Nationals, thanks TJ. And let's get this bell ready for potential train whistles. Let's clear this area a little bit here. Got plenty of top loaders for this. All right, settle in, folks. Oh, Tyler, you know this. You know the answer to that. You've been here long enough to know the answer to that. So once again, sorry, here's here's the list. Once again, I have to move some stuff around. All right, let me just slide these over here. And you can see it on the top camera. I just need to make myself a little wee bit of room. All right, good luck, everybody. There's Topps Chrome Baseball 2020 edition. We're looking at two autographs per box on average. Do I have financial interest in the football games? I do. Colin, you know me well. I couldn't av could not avoid Thursday night. Oh, is, is Nick Jaspi wheeling in here to help out? I know. Yes. I know, we need like a Nick Jaspi. So you can see the transfer of the boxes right here. This will help the break go a little bit more quickly which I appreciate, and then we will probably have more time to kill that football mixer, which is only one uh, one hanger box away, 16 spots away from unlocking 28 boxes of good stuff. Might have to, might have to squeeze in a little dinner in between now and the football mixer, but then we'll, then we'll be fueled and ready to go for the 28 box football mixer. And yeah, we'll do it tomorrow. We just, should we just call him the righty, Sean, out of the bullpen? We'll just watch football, have him do the mixer by himself. Make Ted do it? Yeah. Why is Ted freaking out? Oh, he's facing David Johnson in his football league? In his life? Yeah. That's all he has left in life is just fantasy football, the only thing that brings him joy. Yeah. I've never seen Ted more happier when I walked in today and said hi to him. And he was like, are we going to do an extra long woo-woo for the intro today? Because I was like, yeah, sure, Ted White. It's like, where's that football? Football's back. He's very excited. I was like, all right. I was already fired up. Ted got me real fired up. Um, let's see what my financial interest here is here, Colin. I've got a little bit on Houston on the money line, which is looking pretty good right now <laughs> in the first quarter. Um, I've got, and some crazy props that I put like scratcher money on. I've got like Mahomes, 400 plus yards and three passing touchdowns at plus 725. Brandon Cooks with 150 receiving yards and two touchdowns. Um, that's at plus 12,800, 128 to one. It's not, not very likely, but hey, if you put a dollar on it, you get $120 back. A slightly more realistic one, Brandon Cooks, 70 receiving yards and one touchdown, plus 650. And uh, Deshaun Watson, plus 375, or 375 passing yards, two passing touchdowns at plus 550. That's the only way that they're gonna win. If the, like Cooks and Watson definitely have to get those numbers if they wanna win. All right, here is box one. Can you see? You're all right? 
All right, so we're gonna breeze through these rather quickly. Obviously, stuff like that, Brendan McKay is gonna ship. In the interest of time, we're just gonna, I think really we're only gonna pay attention to Luis Roberts, really, and Kyle Lewis's. There's Justin Dunn, speaking of his teammate. Kyle Lewis's teammate, Justin Dunn, autograph for the Mariners, Kevin Mendoza. Really didn't have, going back to football really quick, I didn't have a, a strong feeling on one side or the other. So, went with fun little props. Kansas City should should pull away by the by the end, I would think. Every over, every over week one? I know, no, no, like no preseason as well. These are preseason games right here, basically. Look at Andy Reid's droplets. See that? He's gassed too. He's breathing heavy. He's breathing heavy into that into his mask. Yeah, his face shield. That is Abraham Toro to fifty. You don't think they were? Well, the gap under. Right, these droplets could still like slip under there, right? If he has it, droplets could be leaking out. I mean, who knows? That's a cool mouth guard for Clyde Edwards Hilaire. Is that Hilaire? Yeah. Who's thirty on this? Oh, I was like, I almost freaked out, and then I realized that we still have gentlemen working on the gutters. Logan Webb going to Gary and the Giants. Gavin Lux starting to heat up a little bit, folks. Dodgers, Richard Miller. Oh, wait. I need a... Sorry, hang on. This is very important. We got two Richard Millers. We have to distinguish between. I already changed in the account, but there's a Maine Miller and a Illinois Miller that we have to not mix up. Nolan Ryan die cut, which is pretty cool. That's Tim Anderson. Eloy. And the White Sox have been looking really good. And we've got a Carter Keyboom, Future Stars. Nationals. That'll be for TJ with the Nats. Nice. Nice key boom. That's a cool design here. Eight out of 99. There you go, on the board early, Tej. Trout, Dunn. Uh, yes, Martin, that is correct. You do have the bin bangers in this. Uh, no, you didn't, Joey. I still need to go through orders after this. Ah, oh, Domingo Leyva, is he running his hand across? Is he a lefty? No, he's... He bats both. Maybe he signs left. Drag, drag the hand across that. Smudged or something. John Alfie's. I don't know. Does, would Tops replace something like that? I don't know. There's Kyle Lewis. He's been playing some good baseball for the Mariners. So is Gavin Lux, playing well for the Dodgers. I think are playing right now. There's, man, there's a lot going on. Wait, real quick, real quick. 
Lakers 84-68 at the end of the day, the game's over. I feel like we missed. I feel like the Rockets aren't the type of team that'll like be like, let's pull out gutsy fourth quarter <laughs> and try to beat the Lakers. Yeah, there was debate about if we were leaving the tennis on in the front four. I was like, yeah, right. I was like, yeah, right. What about it's Jennifer Brady and Naomi Osaka? Naomi Osaka, come on. It better be Prime Serena versus Billie <laughs> like, Jean King out there if we're going to leave it on. There's Nico Horner to 25. Ooh, not a touchdown. Too much mustard on that. Isn't that the second one? Didn't he almost get the first one? Two drops already? Two TD drops already for Demarcus Robinson? It's kind of cool. I feel like Tyree Kill's name hasn't been called once. I think so either. Kelsey, he knows how to catch touchdowns. And we got Andres Munoz, rookie auto for the Padres. That's going to be for Nick Stober. I think Carter Keeboom's pretty he got He's got some upside. Let's just say that. I'm not sure if he's lighting it up just yet, but not like Juan Soto or anything like that. But I think Carter Keeboom, Trey Turner, Victor Robles, Juan Soto, I think are the core of that new, um, of, the, of the, the young core of the Nationals, that is. Jose Urania to 299. Commercials. Robert with the Marlins. The Creep. Oh, no, what happened? No, I'm trying to see what else is on. Tennis. I can't read the scoreboard. Osaka's up. So I can tell you, even if 4-1. I could see it, I wouldn't be able to see it. <laughs> it's 40-40. But what about In the, the third set? There? <laughs> the second numbers mean? to the left. Those are the, those are the sets. Oh, I don't know. I think my four fireworks. So you got to win 15, 30, 40. I know that. That wins you I one thing. Match. And then six things wins the set. Why do they call zero love? Why don't they just say love? I don't know. You can ask the French. <laughs> I think they came up with it. Oh, oh man. That'd be awesome. All right. You are due to receive a rookie autograph of... Well, they're gonna, you're going to see the team first. Okay. What's the first one? C. Cincinnati Reds. Aquino? H. Chicago White Sox, Luis Robert. Ooh, maybe? Chicago L? Give me Chicago L. Give me, give give me Luis Robert. Oh, nice. Woo! That is nice. Matthew Shira picked up the White Sox straight up. Scared money don't make money, folks. Boom. Oh, Malcolm, we're having a great time. We just pulled a Luis Robert rookie autograph for a person who bought a team straight up. No filler, nothing like that. Just said, I'm going to pull the trigger on that. We got that. We got NFL on. We got NBA playoffs on. We got U.S. Open tennis on. All the, all the big sports. I'm sure things are happening in the NHL. They're, they're, they're teasing us on golf right here, too. Oh. Baseball is being played. 
Did you see all those runs scored yesterday? Yeah, the, the Braves scored 29 runs. That was ridiculous. They had a, points because it yeah. Like they already had six runs in the game already against the Nats. Got the Dodgers game coming up a little bit. Probably. And we got Trent Grisham. Padres, Nick Stober. That's pretty amazing, actually. It's better than baseball. <laughs> baseball couldn't even do. But they're not traveling. That's true, yeah. Trent Grisham for Nick Stober and the Padres. The last what? The last Robert sold for 400? Nice. That's not bad. You get that graded, maybe. There's Gold Wave Joey Gallo, 41 out of 50. The Robert Redemption. Oh, maybe live it'll go for more, I would think. If they redeem it, if they grade it, Matthew Sure grades it. Cool. He's going to win AL Rookie of the Year, I would imagine. Not too much competition, right? Jordan Yamamoto was one of the guys that gave up like a million runs yesterday. 2.2 innings and like a lot of earned runs. That's a Luis Robert refractor, I want to say. Yeah, it is. Nice one, Matthew Shear. The hits just keep on coming. Yeah, there it is. Oh, that's a variation, I think. That pochette looks different from the other ones. And there's the negative, refractor, George Springer. Love comes from the French word for egg. Oh, like a goose egg? Got it. That makes sense. See? See? It's the French. It's crazy egg words. Yeah, the variations are... There you go. Nice. That's pretty cool. That's for the Blue Jays, Sean Maddock. He needs you to throw more. Did he, Watson just sit down next to Mahomes and say hi? That's pretty funny. Abraham Toro needs to... He was like, hey, remember the Bears took Trubisky? Yeah. Remember that? Remember the Jags took... He's like, hey, what's up? Astros, Martin. <laughs> it looks like it's a blowout. Like everyone just left <laughs> in the stands. Yeah, it looks like preseason. It looks like, oh yeah, preseason. It's a preseason blowout. And no oh, nice Chris Bryant relic. But yeah, Teddy was saying like Nick Stover, in Cubs. baseball when there's not a lot of fans, you can hear the boos and stuff even more. So that's like, like oh, that'll just, affect people, players more perhaps. Yeah, they can hear heckling more. Nick and Joe, I think you guys need to move out out of the burning state and move to the Midwest. Chicago would be a nice Jaspi home. Like yeah, I was gonna say if there's if someone made me move to a midwestern city, I think it would be Chicago. If someone put a dome over it, so it doesn't snow. It'd be yeah, like yeah, yeah, and then maybe put a nice beach next to it. I guess there's a lake. There's Aaron Saval. And then like decrease the humidity. Like you got to decrease the humidity. Cleveland Indians. That'll be for Robert. Mainly the snow. Man. Yeah, the snow. I wouldn't be able to handle. I already lived through snow. I was that much. That much you, that's right. You grew up in it. You're like forget yeah. it. You have to do a lot of shoveling. Shoveling, you get, power outages. There'd be your car would get stuck in the road if it didn't have good enough chain. Wow, that Bichette variation sold for two oh two hundred bucks basically. TJ saying that's crazy. Well, 
Well, the fires are never near our house. You know? Thankfully. There's Matt Boyd's dying. But snow would be on our house if we moved to Chicago. Yeah, the wildfires don't hit other areas. Yeah. We just have to be afraid of tsunamis. Tsunamis is a thing. Earthquakes. Earthquakes. I'll take that over snow, though. Yeah, the thing about hurricanes or uh, tsunamis, or at least earthquakes, you can't really tell when they're going to happen. Don't want to know. There's Albert Pujols, negative, photo negative for Eric, Jay, and the Angels. Prim says we can go to Colorado for fire and snow. That's a trip. Sean Murphy, Oakland A's, Coppola. Patrick Mahomes. Good for you, buddy. We got Ron Hill Ravello. That's for the Cardinals. Mike G. I always think this is red, a red parallel, but it's not. <laughs> so I heard, I, I was telling the gang this earlier today, the, I don't know if you were listening, the, the most, uh, who sold the most jerseys so far this season? Football. NFL. Dustin May, Green Wave. Tom Brady. Tom Brady. Number two? This is it defense or offense? Offense and number two surprised me. What division? AFC East. <laughs> Frank Gore. Nope. Um, Josh Allen. Nope. It's a quarterback though. Sam Darnold. No. Cam Newton. Uh, number two selling well, jersey. Yeah, because everybody already has the other guys. Right. <laughs> well, yeah. Those guys are on your teams, right? Correct, yes. That makes sense. But then, like, third was, like, George Kittle, someone someone said, and then, like, a couple other players that were still on their I think so, yeah. All right. Yeah, once, well, once we get that Spotify money, Rex, then we'll just, we'll just break, we'll just have apartments everywhere, and we'll just break whenever we, wherever we feel like. It's like, hey, today feels like it's a big game in Chicago. Let's go break there. Just have a little mini Jaspi concert, a little Jaspi fest. You know, yeah, maybe I'll get a ranch in, in Texas. There's no fires in Texas, right? I can't. I wouldn't get a ranch here. <laughs> I feel like there'd be brush fire area. Keen Wong for um, the Giants. That's for Gary, who I think, yeah, his brother's Colton. Thank you, Nick. Clyde Edwards Alaire, dust off those rookie cards. And there's Jordan Alvarez, rookie auto for Martin, who won that spot in the jumbo pack break. Thirty-five out of four ninety-nine. Once we get Spotify money, we all get a free case break of eighteen nineteen Prism. No, that's not how we get Spotify money by giving things away for free. No, sir. Yeah, we actually had a Bo Bichette short print, which is pretty cool looking. Is that gold, Hunter Dozier? It is.
Hunter Dozier for the Royals. That gold is going to Jarrell Taylor. More Bo Bichette's going out to uh, Sean Maddock. What is the gigantic creature that can come into my home whenever it, whenever it wants? What kind of monster is out there, Rex? In Texas. I don't want to see that. You don't have alligators in Texas. What would it, a giant armadillo, maybe? More Luis Roberts go along with that autograph, Matthew Shearer. Giant spiders? No, no thanks. No thanks. I guess everything's bigger in Texas, Joey. I guess so. I think Shane Beaver, you Darvish might get Cy Youngs by the end of the year. I think there's only like, what, 15, 15 16 games left? Giant Chris Collinsworth sneaking to your homes. And in orange, Anthony Santander. 23 out of 25 for the O's. Thomas Bowes won the Orioles. And Kyle Garlic, rookie auto for the Dodgers. Richard Miller. Well, I think we've learned now that it's not so much that his tips, pitches were being tipped, and the pitches were being stolen by certain people. Not him, though. And we got Michael Baez for the Padres, Nick Stober. Zach Collins, another autograph for the White Sox, Matthew Shira. This whole this this whole Jaspi thing doesn't work out, Rex. I guess I could just move in with you and work for Sweetwater. There's Bobby Bradley autograph. Yeah, well, I've got a backup now, Rex. Yeah, with every with every carry, Jeffrey, you're right. Clyde Edwards Hilaire cards are going up. Face mask for a second. Harold Ramirez, 75. Yeah, stop running Daryl Williams. More Clyde Edwards Hilaire. That's hashtag good for the hobby. Thank you. 
Gotta check on check on the Lakers. Sandy Koufax die cut. The Lakers are cruising 99 to 78 with 740 left in the fourth quarter. Oh, there you go, Lakers. Doing work. I have no idea, Laser. Did you ask what's next? How am I supposed to know? I've been breaking for the last 30 minutes. Here's the last box right here. I think I was going through orders at the same time doing this. Figuring out breaks. I wish I had two extra hands. Logan Allen to 299. Robert with the uh, Robert Primrose with the tribe. Watkins touchdown. Sammy Watkins with those three touchdowns opening day last year against Jacksonville in tonight to give the Chiefs their first lead of the game. Yeah, little return round on the outside and over the top is going to come Kelsey. So as he comes back out, Kelsey is flashing the, the corner. Justin Verlander relic. Yeah, it looks like they take they take throwback cards. The throwback design, and then make it a relic card. That's what it looks like. Tigers edition of Verlander. That'll be for Capola. Can I take that blue card or not at all? Yes, you can now take it. Actually. No, 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 it's not you coming across as rude. It's just, it's just funny when, it's like a common sense thing. Like, how am I, how would I know what's next? <laughs> One out of 50 when I've been in the middle of doing this. Colin Posh, for, that's why I was laughing, Rhea. Just one man, Laser Jet. Just one man. Just trying to get through this Topps Chrome Baseball break before I go through some more orders and see what else is going to happen after this. Um, no, I think his knee went down a little bit early. Rex, I asked about this a year ago. Do you think we'll do pack breaks at some point? We do do pack breaks. We do pack breaks all the time to help fill up breaks. In fact, we did a jumbo pack break to fill up this break. Nice Kyle Lewis autograph. Kevin Mendoza with the M's. Has Kyle Lewis still been uh has he still been hitting? What's what's his what's his dilly yo? Kyle Lewis? No, has been slumping a little bit in the last week. But still nice though. Promising start to hopefully a long career, Kevin. That's the sound of true friendship. Because when you have the ten dollar taco and burrito crazy. Lakers and football, both commercials? No. Oh, 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 like, uh, like everyone gets a pack. Yeah, I'm sure we'll do that. I, th I think price-wise, it gets a little expensive sometimes. I think it would work best with, like, a Spectra football break or something like that. See, oh, I said knee, huh? That was elbow. I thought I got it. The elbow went down first. No touchdown. All right, Michael. I'll see you in a bit. Ooh, 
I thought that was Clyde Edwards Lair first first TD. It was twas not to be. Kyle Lewis hyper. It's another good one for Kevin and the M's. And there's Sam Hilliard for the Rocks. George Cobb got the Rockies. Or does he? I think that probably works best with stuff like that. Prism draft football, like one auto a pack. But I don't know. I'm not sure if we're going to do it, do something like that too often. I think to go one at a, one box at a time sometimes is a little inefficient to try to rock through a case. Roostar Grayroll, still Twins edition in this one, goes to David Ross. Cubs manager joining our breaks. Good to see you, Coach. 89 out of 250 on that one. And the last box, ladies and gentlemen. Good luck. Ooh, I think the dinner is here. And look at this, an Orioles autograph. It's going to be Hunter Harvey for the O's. Thomas Bove. Dustin May, Blue Wave, 19 out of 75. I love when the parallel matches the color of the team. And Richard Miller with my Dodgers. And another, there's Aaron's brother, Austin Nola, rookie autograph for the M's. Didn't Austin Nola get traded? One oh three eighty seven, three forty left for the Lakers. There we go, Lakers. Is that the Lakers MO? Lose game one and then figure it out? And then not let teams come back into it? Another Kyle Lewis, nice. Oh, Asanola went to San Diego. That's right. And my friends, that is that. That's a nice trout right there, too, for the Angels. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. And that was a 12-box uh, Topps Chrome Baseball Break, 2020 edition. All 12 boxes. Pick your team, number 14. Here's a quick little autograph and Luis Robert recap. Nice relics there, too. Davis just catches it. That's not even a forced turnover. He just doesn't know where he is on the floor. Steps out of bounds. Some nice autos. A couple cool relics in the mix. There's that Boba Shed short print, which is pretty nice. A Luis Robert refractor. Luis Robert autograph. Carter Keyboom at the beginning. And some Justin Dunn as well. So pretty awesome stuff, ladies and gentlemen. Big thanks to everybody who got into the action. Really appreciate it. I'm Joe once again, and I'll see you next time on jazbeescasebreaks.com.